Hi, I'm Chef Mike, and welcome to Fry's Culinary 411. Today is a delicious poached Alaska halibut with tomato basil sauce. So let's get started. Let's start by heating our skillet over a medium high heat for at least one minute. Next, we'll add the private selection olive oil to the pan and swirl the coat well. Next, we'll add our shallots and we'll saute for about one minute. Now let's remove our pan from the heat source and add our white wine. We're using Sauvignon Blanc today. When the wine reduces by half, we'll add our bottle of clam juice. When the simmer returns, we're going to add our wild Alaska halibut filet. It's important to remember when you're poaching to have a very, very low simmer going. Oh, it's looking good. Let's go ahead and give it a turn. You can tell your halibut's done because it begins to separate and flake. Now let's go ahead and set our halibut filet on our serving plate and we'll set them aside. Next, we'll turn the heat to the pan up to high. We'll reduce the liquid by half to concentrate the flavors. In the meantime, we're going to slice our basil up into what the French call a chiffonade cut, which is ribbon-like cut. Stack your basil leaves up on top of each other. We'll roll them up. Then we'll make thin slices. For some nice ribbons. Now you can also find this squeezed basil in the produce department of the fry stores. It's a great value because it lasts weeks in your refrigerator, unlike fresh basil which only has a shelf life of maybe three days at home. Next we'll add our fresh basil to the pan and we'll add our diced tomatoes. We'll finish with one pat of butter. Wow, it really smells great. Let's plate it up. 